Hello everyone, my name is Hamza Salim. It doesn't matter what your name is. And welcome to this video. Today I will show you how you can create your own shop using Svelte Kit and uh, Binance Pay as a payment method. So the project is very easy to deploy. What do you need in this project is just two things. The first thing is the product and the second thing is a Binance Pay account. To simplify the process, what do you need here is the API key, the API secret, the base URL for Binance and the merchant ID. And all these values, you can take it from the merchant application. So the first thing that you have to do to uh, receive payments in Binance Pay that you should have a Binance account and a merchant account. So to simplify the process and who can use Binance Pay and why you will use Binance Pay. Today, imagine that you want to ask users to uh, pay for uh, a simple uh, product. The simple integration is just to create a store and the store will in be integrated to MetaMask and you will ask the users to pay in crypto using metamask users have to pay money for transaction fees and this is the huge problem with anything related to crypto now uh, no one want to pay fees especially for example in ethereum when you want to just to send a hundred dollar you have to pay seven dollar or maybe like sometimes twelve dollar if you want to pay usdt or usdc this is too much for any crypto user so the easiest way to do this is to do it off chain or at least like in another platform like binance i think binance pay provide a method an easy method for user to prevent paying transactions in the blockchain a lot of our transaction that we want to do we don't want to do it in, in blockchain and everyone have an account in binance and the simplest way to do that is okay I give you the service, you pay it in Binance, and that's it. Think about it as a user, you will just give anyone your Binance ID, and that's it. But think about it as a merchant. If you have a lot of services and you want people who have Binance account to pay you, the easiest way to do it using Binance Pay API. So this is the project and the, the integration, as I said, you need this keys and also you need the products i built this project in top of svelte kit commerce and this is one of the uh, simple shops that you can see this shop is very easy it's also integrated to uh, shopify but i will assume that you don't have an account in shopify and you don't want to create your store based on shopify so what i will uh, i assume that everyone want to just put their own product and they have this json file for products as you see this is for example the simple one you just add to cart and you can just go and check out using Shopify. And this is like the simple uh, simple uh, project that I, uh, I built my integration based on. So let's back to our project. Our project is also simple. You can say um, it's the same process. However, when you click here, you will pay using Binance. Let's run it locally and show you how you can run such as project. So I'll assume that you already have the project. So if I will just say get clone and seems that the project already exists. So I will just go to the project itself. And the first thing that you need to do is to set up the product. They already have like a product that you can see, but also to add the credential from the API key and the secret in the uh, .env file. So as you see here is the project. Uh, what I will do here, I will just say npm uh, already install everything. npm um, run dev. This is the data. This is the products that we have. So now I'm here. I will try to buy any any product here i will just click here and you can just say pay in binance pay so what you are expecting here you're expecting this qr or the checkout url and that's mean that you can just go and check out and pay using binance pay this is the easiest way to to run the project as you see this is the amount this is the merchant name this is the product name and this is the product details you guys developers i will give you the chance to contribute for such as project what i will do here i will create issues that already not solved in the project as you see the project have several issues that have to be done for example 
The first thing is how we can confirm that this guy paid or not. It doesn't matter what you think. What? For digital product, how we can confirm that this person paid. This is the first issue. Now we have to check another API in Binance Pay. This is the first issue. Second issue, as you see, I'm paying for each product. Maybe it's easier to integrate it to the checkout. The checkout, proceed to checkout. You have to check out all the products. And the last thing is how we can rearrange this project to be scalable and make it, for example, as a SaaS product. This is the challenges that I will give you guys to try to solve.